Welcome to episode 18 of FTCE Seminar, a teacher certification podcast. I'm your host, Mercedes Musto. In today's episode, I'll be talking about how to use a podcast to study so you can learn. Let's get started. Here are five podcasting study tips. Tip number one, listening time. Are you a morning listener or a middle of the night listener? Or maybe you like to put on your earbuds in the early afternoon while enjoying a midday latte? Hey, you do you, right? Tip number one, listening time, means exploring what time of day works best for you. At first, I thought that I could listen to an educational podcast while driving or cleaning the house, but the research shows that students prefer listening to podcasts while sitting on the couch or laying in a bed. In fact, many students are wholly focused on listening without interruptions. How cool is that? Tip number two, play then pause. To get the most out of educational podcasts, use the skill of active listening. Active listening requires us to be fully present, giving our full attention to the speaker. What this means is to use active listening along with tip number two, play then pause. We play, then pause the podcast to concentrate on the concepts being shared. The pause gives us informational processing time to really digest what we need to learn. Add active listening to your play then pause technique to get the most out of an educational podcast. Tip number three, replay to reinforce. Replay is one of the best characteristics of a podcast. Not only can you process what you've learned on a podcast, but then you can also go back and replay the section you found interesting or confusing, or maybe you got distracted. I mean, right, that never happens to me, but for real, for real. While you are deeply focused and active listening, you may want to pause the podcast, go back a few seconds, and then replay the information and that reinforces what you know. So try tip number three, replay to reinforce. Tip number four, take notes. I probably could have made this tip tip number one, but I didn't. Either way, this podcast, you would want to replay this podcast and pause it and take notes. Boom, it all makes so much sense now. So this is how it works. First, go to FTCE seminar and get yourself a practice test for the FTCE or professional education exam. Then take the practice test. How did you do? Let's say you found the English language skills section of the general knowledge practice test particularly challenging. What do you do now? You plug into Spotify, Audible, or YouTube, wherever you get your podcast. Practice some active listening. Press pause. Take notes and replay the concepts you need to reinforce your knowledge. Educational podcasting is such a chill way to study. Put on an episode. Take notes on your iPad, sip on a cafe latte, and then share some notes with your friends. Collaboration, that's how it's done. And now, tip number five, discuss and share. We've talked a lot about how to get the most out of an educational podcast. The last tip, tip number five, is to discuss and share. Form a student study group with the people who are preparing for the same exam and share study resources. Discussing what you've learned not only helps you comprehend the material, but it also helps you practice your knowledge of the content through dialogue. Sometimes we just need to talk things out with another person to gain perspective and encouragement. You know, the encouragement we need before taking the test. So discuss and share these tips with another person and offer encouragement. You'll be glad you did. Let's review. Use these five tips to get the most out of an educational podcast. Tip number one. Choose a good time of day to listen, whatever works for you. Tip number two, play pause so that you can really focus on the concepts. Tip number three, replay to reinforce what you've learned. I love this idea. Tip number four, take notes, whether it's on your phone or tablet or just jot down a few notes while you're listening. And tip number five, discuss and share. That's always good advice. Discuss and share, having trouble with the concept? Discuss and share and hey, like this podcast. That's right, discuss and share. For more study hacks, visit ftceseminar.com. You can also visit us on Spotify, Audible, or your favorite podcast player to start studying. The important thing is start studying and start studying today. Well, what are you waiting for? Check us out on YouTube at FTCE Seminar and start studying today. This is your host, Mercedes Musto. Join me again on FTCE Seminar, a Florida teacher certification exam podcast. Shout out to UWF. This podcast was recorded at the Pickens Multimedia Studio at the University of West Florida.